Hello, Andy Roper here, Form Tech Fitness. As a fitness professional, I am working with clients constantly about their form and their technique of movement. One of the most challenging movements that I see and I have with clients to do efficiently and effectively is Roman deadlifts, stiff leg deadlifts, where you're holding a barbell, ideally, or dumbbells, and you drop the hips back. Ideally, you're trying to stretch the hamstrings, activate the hamstrings, the glutes, thrust in. It's a great movement, it's one of my favorite movements, but some clients have a challenge keeping their head up, their chest up, and, and even more importantly, they have a flexion problem, sometimes in the Achilles, more times in the hip girdle, where they're not able to drop the hips the whole way down the negative, and so their lower back gets exposed, they drop their head, they drop their mid back, and they end up sort of subconsciously pumping up the lower back, the spinal rectors get pumped up and they have pain and discomfort in the back or the lower back. So to alleviate that, you can use a leg extension to help form for stiff leg deadlifts or Roman deadlifts. If you have a leg extension, grab have your clients or yourself practice, obviously get this where you can do it yourself, grab the foot pedal of a leg extension Stand right under, get your heels right under the foot pedal of, of a leg, a circular leg extension where most of them have a circular movement. Rock into the negative, have your clients rock into the negative, or you practice yourself, rock into the negative, shift into your heels, thrust your glutes into the positive. Feel that you're stretching the hamstrings on the negative, thrust on the positive. The tempo is three, two, one, one, two, thrust. Three, two, one, one, two, thrust. I'm using about, it says 100 pounds of resistance here, which is minimal. This is a minimal amount of resistance for, for stiff leg deadlifts or RDLs. But it's a lot easier to maintain good form. You can have partial ranges of motion and still feel that you're activating the hamstring, shift and thrust. Because you're really not having to use the same range of motion, you have this uh, set pathway of the barbell, if you will, so people are less likely to drop their head, drop their back, and activate their lower back. So try this with a, with a leg extension, Roman deadlifts, using the leg extension, heels under this foot pedal, thrust. Three, two, one, one, two, thrust. I can already feel that I'm activating my hamstrings. And your roper. Form Tech Fitness, hit the like button, talk to you soon, make it a great day.